All right, hi guys. You know, just Baby Echo and I singing and dancing again. I hope at home you're remembering to take time to do some movement breaks. Your teeth might be cutting that in your teeth as well. So make sure that you're getting up, moving around, not looking at the screen more than you have to, and taking care of yourself in your learning. So, speaking of learning, it looks like we still have some letters missing and we need to get to work. Are you ready to see what the letters of the day are? Drum roll, please. We have two letters today. The first one is E. And what color is it, guys? Salmon color, that means it's a vowel, so we can stretch out the sound. And check out our picture here. It's a man, and he's wearing a shirt that says his name. His name is Ed. And the sound that E makes is E. Eh. So we say E, Ed, E. Eh. You try it. E, Ed, E. Eh. Very nice. Let me find my stammer card. There it is. Let's see, where does it go? Help me sing the ABCs. A, B, C, D, E. Ah. There it is. Our first row is complete. Isn't that so exciting? Okay. And now let's look at our next letter of the day. R. And here's our keyword. It's a rat. And the sound that R makes is R. Here's our standard R. Let's do our ABCs. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R. All right. So we only have a few more missing. Let's practice those ones. E, Ed, F. R, Rat, Er. Very nice job, everybody. Okay, it is time for us to add to sing our vowels now. We can take off our little stickies over our E because we've now talked about all of our vowels. Are you ready to sing with me? Here we go. A apple a e a e i itch e o octopus a u a a nice job singing everybody. Okay, my friends, time for us to practice writing e and r. They are both plain line round letters. So that means we know that they are going to start on the plain line and they're going to have some curves. But it's important that you know E is a special letter because it actually starts below the plain line. So watch me do it first. Point between the plain line and grass line. Fly under the plain line. Then go up to the plane line, go around to the grass line, E, Ed, E. Watch me do it again. I fly under, I go up and around and down to the grass line, E, Ed, E. Okay, are you ready to skywrite with me? Okay, show me that you're ready. You're standing. Shake it out. Get your pointer fingers ready. Okay, that's what I'm going to visualize as I write in the sky. Here we go. Point between the plane line and grass line. Say it back. Fly under the plane line. Then go 
up to the plain line, then around to the grass line. E and F. Let's do it one more time. Point between the plain line and grass line. Fly under the plain line. Go around the plain line and down to the grass line. E and F. Nice job, my friends. Now you should take your whiteboard on either side that you'd like and practice at least three E's. After you write each one, please make sure that you're saying E, Ed, Eh. Make sure you're holding your pencil or marker the right way. And make sure you're going in the right order. You might have learned to do these letters a different way. This is the time to fix those things and get your letters formed the correct way. Because when you're older, you're going to be writing pages and pages of writing. And you want to have the letters the right way so you can write quickly and neatly. Okay. Pause here and do a whole row of E's. Okay, you're back. That means you must have finished your E's. I want you to circle your favorite one, the one that you think is neatest. I like this one. Now for our other letter of the day, the letter R. Who remembers the picture for R? Yeah, rat. Ugh. And what does that letter say? R. R. Okay. Let me find my letter R. And I'm going to show you exactly how to do it before I have you get up and skywrite with me. So R is also a plain line letter. So, we know it starts on the plain line. You go down to the grass line, trace back up to the plain line, and make a little curve. R, rat, fur. Watch me again. Point to the plain line, go down to the grass line, trace back up to the plain line, and make a curve. R, rat, fur. Okay, let's sky write it. Nice and straight, two fingers out. Let's picture rainbow colors shooting out today. Here we go. Repeat after me. Point to the plain line. Go down to the grass line. Trace back up to the plain line and make a little curve. R, rat, R. Grab your whiteboards and go ahead. Do as many R's as you can fit on whichever side is right for you. Pause here to do them. Okay, if you're back, it means you finished your R's. Hmm, this is my favorite one because I really took my time and I stayed on top of the grass line. I went a little bit under on my other ones. We're not perfect. Are you perfect? No, no way. Baby Echo, are you perfect? No. None of us are perfect. That's why we're at school, to keep learning and getting better. And I need to learn and get better from you guys too. So we have one more. Well, actually, what do you say we practice some letters that we've already done? Okay. Get your whiteboard ready and tell me which letter says uh. Say uh. Which letter says uh? You. Very good. Can you write a U? U, uh, uh. Which letter says G? Say G. Which one? G, that's right. Show me how to do a G. It's a plain line round letter, yep, and it goes all the way down to the worm line and makes a huck. Very nice. Okay, let's practice. Let's practice the E. One more time. Mm -hmm. What letter says ah? E. Good. Show me your E. Make sure it flies between the plain line and the grass line. Good. And how about one more? Which letter says ah? Which one? A. It's also a plain line round letter. Show me your A. Beautiful. Okay, your last job today, my friends, is 
to add these two new letters to your student notebook. So let's start with R. It's a consonant, and they come first. So find the consonant R. What's the letter's name? Point to it. Good. The name is R. What's the keyword? The picture? A rat. Rat. So what's the sound? Er. Color in that rat. And when you finish, we'll do our other word of the day. Find the E on the page with the vowels. The short vowels. You see it there? There's our friend Ed. Everyone point to the letter's name. What's the letter? E. What's the picture? Ed. Ed. And what's the sound? Ed. Awesome job today, everybody. You are doing so great. And before you know it, all of our alphabet is going to be filled and we get to start making and reading words. Ooh. All right. I'll see you next time, guys. Have a good night.